Hey there, I'm your host Les Sawi, and in today's video I will show you how to create a moving platform. So if I go and hit the play button, we can see the platform moving and we can also jump on it and the player will move with the platform. So with all this said, let's begin. Open up your project and let's go to the content drawer. Now over here, I will right click and create a folder for my platform and let's call this platform. Now once inside of here, we want to right click once again and create a blueprint class, which will be of type actor, and I'll call it BP underscore moving platform. So once inside of this, you want to add something that the player can stand on. So this could be a static mesh or whatever you like. In my case, I'll simply add a cube. And for the name, let's call it platform. Now for the scale, let's do something like tree, tree and 0.1. And that's looking good. We can also set the material for this so it's not so uh, bright. Let's do wood and it should come up. And that's looking nice. So now if you select self, we can add something called interp to movement. And this will allow our platform to move. So for this, we also can create a variable. And let's call this destination. So uh, make this of type vector. And over here in the instance editable, say true and also show 3D widget. So by showing the widget, we can essentially just drag the widget within our world. And that will be the destination that the platform will move to. So go to the construction script, drag the interp to movement and do add control point position. So 000 stands for the origin of the platform. So no matter where you place the actor, um, the placement, that position of the actor will be its starting position. So now select this and copy paste that. And over here, we can select our destination and this will be the position that the platform will move to. So one more thing we can actually do. If you select the interp to movement, you see behavior type. If you leave it as one shot, it will only be done once. So you want it at ping pong. So it goes back and forth. We can also set the duration inside of here maybe like five seconds. And if we compile and save, we can put the platform inside of our world. And if you see this little widget here, we can drag this out and wherever you drag it out, that's the position the platform will move to. So if we hit the play button, we can see the platform moving. It's going to go there and then it will go back to its starting position. We can also increase the speed, not in the event blueprint, but inside of here. So simply select your platform and go to interp to movement, and we can do something like one second, which will make it very fast. So if we hit play again, we can see it moving very quickly. And with this said, thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, leave a like. If you didn't, leave a dislike. And as always, happy developing.